Bro, I don't know what I could do to prove it to you, man. Omori is mid. Don't be too hasty now, Donnie. We've discussed this. You agreed that it was peak. It was last week. I have changed my mind now. It's mid now. No, it's a masterpiece. Your mom's a masterpiece. No, your mom's a... Wait, isn't that a compliment? It is. When I was in bed with her last night. Mmm. Great ass. Stop talking out of your ass, Donald. I was with her all night. You live with your mom, Biden? Shut up, Barack. Family business. None of your concern. I have photo evidence. See? That's me. Up, and that's her. Below. Irrefutable evidence. F off, Donald. Even my dead children have better photoshopping skills than you. Well, I could photoshop Kel in there, make it canon. You motherfuck. Oh, why did you stop? Go on, say it. It's accurate. I F your mom. Gentlemen, please, I think we're getting off topic. We were discussing which Omori characters were the best. Aubrey, easy S tier. Hottest character in the game. More like C tier. We all know Mari is the best character. Low diff. More like worst bitch. Low diff. She barely even appears in the game. Most times it's as ghosts, corpses, or delusions. What's with you and dead children? At least she didn't try to push her friend off a cliff. That's bullshit, Joe, and you know it. It was an accident, plain and simple, and pushing someone into a lake barely counts as a cliff. Calm down, gentlemen. We can all agree that each character have their own merits and flaws. Shut up, Obananana. The only thing more mid than Mari is your opinion. I hate to say it, Barrack, but I'm with the balding duck on this one. Stop being so politically correct all the time and tell us what you really think. It's just us here. It's not like there's an illegal spy satellite listening in on our hot takes. Besides, don't we own all of those? Mari is mid. What? Mari is mid. Told you, Brian. Aubrey is hotter than Mari. Obama, you and me, man, we... Aubrey is mid. Take that Donald, you stupid asshat. Shut up, Brian. Shut up, oh, banana. Now, Aubrey is hotter than both of your wives and wifes. Look, gentlemen, you wanted my real opinion. You got my real opinion. Sonny is the Giga Chad here. No diff. Oh, wow. So you're going for default. What a mid opinion. I guess that's why people call you the mid president. Shut up, Donald. Nobody said that. And at least I didn't get kicked out of the office after only one term. Shut up, oh, banana. Now, at least people laugh when I tell jokes. I don't have to rely on some cheap third rate anger management comedian retard to tell jokes for me. Donald. The only reason why people laugh at your jokes is because they're laughing at you. Don't stray from the main topic, Brian. We were talking about how Mari was mid. No, Mari is a Giga Chad. Brian, you stupid asshat. Giga Chad is a male. So, who says women can't be Giga Chads? I'm not saying women can't be Giga Chads, Brian, you bastard. Stop the cap. I'm not trying to get canceled. I'm saying corpses can't be Giga Chads. Donald, you piece of shit. Gentlemen, calm down, all right? Uh, What about Hero? He's S tier. -tier. -tier. Right, at least we can agree on something. That man has a mind of a saint. I'm just some lowly politician. Look, all I'm saying is that Mari is F tier because that whole flashback sequence at the end is stupid and made no damn lick of sense. But it was so touching and emotional. Nobody's saying that it's not, Brian. It's just bad writing, okay? S tier for making me whine harder than my ex-wife, but F tier for logic. Well, I thought that flashback was perfect. It was a satisfying conclusion to a perfect game. Sonny finally reconciled with himself and confronted the truth on what happened that fateful day all those years ago. F off, Biden. Oh, you got my name right? F off, Brian. The only thing that made less sense than that ending was me losing the election to you. It's like whoever wrote this game wrote the entire storyline for this sad excuse of a matrix we live in. Do I sense skill issue? F off, Obama. Oh, banana, nah, you don't know what you're talking about. I could have written a better ending with five minutes, two Big Macs, and maybe a chocolate shake. I don't know, Donald. I'm with Biden on this one. The reveal was perfect. Sonny breaking the light bulb, confronting something. Collecting memory fragments in the form of pictures. What's not to love? Are you people stupid? The reveal was sure as shooting as perfect, but the execution was stupid. There are plot holes everywhere. I don't see any plot holes. Do you, Biden? Nope. Donald is talking out of his ass again. How do you explain the police? The police? The police? No, your mom. Of course the police. They must have conducted an autopsy on the body. Fingerprints, DNA samples, discrepancies. You're telling me these two idiot children could have gotten away with it? They're even more retarded than my ex-wife. Uh, Donald, I don't think we have even established that the authorities were even there in the first place. Oh, banana, no, I'm not stupid, okay? Don't treat me like a mentally retarded person. It's more likely for the police to be involved than not to be involved in cases like these. Let's be real here. Well, there's evidence in the story that the parents didn't call the police because they knew about the truth of the entire situation and they wanted to protect the kids. This fan theory is pretty solid. And that might explain why Sonny's father practically disowned him. Shut up, Brian. What evidence? I don't see no evidence. Shut up, Donald. I have more playtime than you do. Oh, yeah? How much? I have over 100 hours, you bastard. You don't want to challenge me. Amateur, I have over 1,000, you asshat. Oh, really? Imagine being proud of wasting over 1,000 hours of your time on a video game. Imagine spending thousands of hours running a presidential campaign and lose. Oh, I bet you're that one guy who has over 9,000 on Animal Crossing on Reddit, huh? Uh, 
That's besides the point, Donald. I know more about the game than you do. Donald, you don't know what you're talking about. Don't use my words against me, Brian, or else I'm going to push you down the stairs harder than when Sonny pushed Mari at March 10th speed on that recital night. Try me, Donald. I have a spare rope here. I could you to whip your ass and then hang it on a tree like a Christmas decoration. Try me, bitch. You can't do worse than my ex-wife. Restraint, gentlemen, restraint. We are all friends here. Donald, I do agree that it was a little strange that the circumstances in which Sonny and Basil got away with the manslaughter was a little dubious. However, Joe's theory makes sense. And let's not forget that the main focus of the game is on forgiveness and overcoming drama, not some glorified detective case. This game isn't exactly L.A. noir. I think we can let this slide. Fine, but it's still mid. Donald, save your words, Biden. That man made up his mind 10 minutes ago. Don't try looking cool making that Breaking Bad reference, oh, banana -na. It's cringe. It makes you look like a dork, and everybody knows it. You ain't impressing anybody with this? Look, uh, let's just get back on topic, gentlemen. How about the hooligans? The hooligans, they're mid. Is anyone who is not Aubrey mid to you, Donald? You're not even giving any of them a chance. Basically, yes, except for that one yellow-haired guy, the, uh, the Logan Paul ripoff guy. He looks kind of hot. But, oh, wait, I just remembered I'm not gay, so... Mid. Well, I think they're solid. Vance and Kim's story was quite heartwarming to uncover. Mid. F you, Donald. Well, F you, Brian. Story? What story? I didn't see no story. All they do is cause me annoyance. I can't even remember any of their names. All I remember is that I beat their asses with a pepper spray. Wait, Donald, didn't you do the side quest? Side quest? What side quest? Any sections without Aubrey is boring as F. I speed ran all of those. Wait, so you're telling me you spent 100 hours in this game while skipping most of it? Basically, yeah. Problem? Most people completed in 20, including side quests. What did you two spend the next 80 hours on? Uh, look, Brian, that's none of your business, okay? We were rating Omori characters, remember, you senile asshat? Or did you want to tell me you have dementia? Hmm, all right, I've got a good one. What about Daddy Long Legs? Daddy Long Legs, Daddy Long Legs, yeah, sure, I love Daddy Long Legs. Right, right, he's great, right? Personally, I have him in my... Mid. Excuse me? You heard what I said? Mid. So, uh, Donald... The only character that you like is a 12-year-old underage girl? Don't be silly, Obananana. She's 16. Still underage. Not in some countries. Not gonna lie, bro. That's kind of sus. Shut up, you asshats. I'm just making an observation. Do I seem like a creep? Yes, absolutely. I hate to say yes, it, without a doubt. Yes. It's just an observation, bro. It seems like your senile minds are so corrupted by memes and mid-grade Wattpads fan fiction that you read too deep into it. Let's just get back on topic. What about Sweetheart, huh? Do you hate her too? Of course I don't hate, sweetheart, you stupid bastard. We all own sweetheart body pillows here. You're the one with the knockoff made in China dog water ass perfect heart pillow. She and Hero is right up there with Aubrey, just not as hot. You take that back, Donald, you effing ass licker. Perfect heart is my waifu. Well, I'm telling you that your waifu is mid and bad and ugly, and so is your entire political career. Speaking of Aubrey, wasn't she on the hooligans? So didn't you just technically rated her mid? No, she wasn't, you asshat Obanana. Now, maybe you should get a pair of glasses and some new eyeballs. Nope, Donald, she was on the hooligans. Jesus, boy, just how much weren't you no, paying attention? No, she wasn't. Attention? Shut the F up, shut the F up, shut the F up, shut the 